One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay, everything's all good. Three, two, one. Wow, that was good. Hello, everybody. Welcome to the stream. It is the B and Dao stream today at 8:30 p.m. Australian Eastern Daylight Time uh, on the 12th of December, 2022. That's right. We are really near the end of the year. Um, I hope you have had a wonderful week, or will have a wonderful week ahead, uh, and have had a good day because today is today. It is Monday. Um, I've had a pretty good. Pretty good week, pretty chill. Um, weather was funky in Sydney today, if anyone was in there. Um, but uh, yeah, how about let's just jump right into it, because I know I know you all cannot wait for what this is. Um, let's just go in. Here we go. Boonk. Prepare yourselves yet again, because it is yet another Mary, Kate, and Ashley video game. You know what they say about games with twins? There's two of them. And uh, that's exactly what this is. And a follow-up to 2000's great hit game, Mary-Kate and Ashley Magical Mystery Mall, comes Mary-Kate and Ashley Crush Course, released in 2001, developed also by Enspace and published by Acclaim. Also, yes, uh, 2001. It's starting to cut it for the PS1. It's like there's PS2 games coming out. But we got Jules Star Interactive making the shots and they said no, more people have PS1s than PS2s, therefore it makes more sense to release a game for the PS1. Obviously. So, Endspace, unfortunately, does not have uh, their old little intro logo. Uh, real games for real girls trademark. Well, if I'm not a real girl, does this mean this is not a real game for me? Who knows. This is the only one with music. Please don't visit this domain, it doesn't work anymore. But you can try and search it on America Online. The Bally High School, home of the Bobcats. I swear there are so many US schools where Bobcats or, you know, the same overlapping uh, kinds of things are their mascots. So we're, we're not doing the mall, we're doing the school. Uh, this is... Uh, Equally terrifying Olsen twins. That's right, I think they actually used the same model twice. They they cheerlead, they shoot hoops. What else do girls do? That's right. Peg. Oh, I shouldn't have said that. They throw ball. No. They hit the... Mm. They take photos. There we go, that's safer. Now, unfortunately, they didn't listen to me with my feet comment last time, so uh, they've done it again. Uh, but that's right, they have mini golf, pinball, sinking it. And they jam, they're jamming again. You know, it looks a little more natural this time. Mm, a little more. They're going, they're going. And they just managed to do it before the end of class, and there's the... Yeah, okay. You, you probably couldn't quite imagine it was them until you see pictures of them and go, oh, okay. Now, I just want to hold on this title screen for a bit. One, because, wow, that audio is... Whoever does the EQ on various video games and just, like, the audio is all over the place. But I just want to wait on this for a moment because there's just a full motion video demo that just, like, you know, get your hype for the game. Um, demos are really interesting just, like, when you wait on the title screen. I assume they want you to like, or they want stores to have this game in a little, you know, in a little box playing. It's like, wow! Pick the boys, yeah! Uh, cheerlead, okay, sure. More boys. It's so JPEG, by the way, like, you cannot read anything. And then, uh, he walks to a bin and that was it. That was the demo. There's a few others. Um, let's see if the sound is, yeah, the sound is low. Come on, come on guys, it doesn't need to be half volume. At least the vibration's on. Um, so let's meet the boys, shall we? We gotta, like, we gotta know who the boys are in this case. There was one skateboard dude in the, the full motion video at the beginning. But who else do we have? Why yes, we have... Chad, <laughs> did you catch our math team finals on TV? Absolutely. I rigged it up to play on the TVs in the physics lab. 
This is like the nerdiest thing is to just turn on TVs to television like broadcasts. I appreciate his favorite food is wings, but unfortunately, unlike me, he's a Scorpio, so no go. Um, these are the nerds, right? Why is one of them? Oh, I guess one of them is biking. Biking is a very nerdy thing. So to the next boys. Dylan, Groff for a TD pass. 21, 32, 44, on two, hut, hut, hike. And Brandon connects for the TD bomb with only seconds on the clock while Dylan hits an eagle on his final five holes to take home the title. I, I feel like you can only tell who's talking when they refer to the other person. Dylan, I'm not Dylan. Like, yeah, okay. Um, you think the cheeseburger wouldn't be his favorite food if you're weightlifting. You gotta listen to that soft rock though, I'll tell you that. He loves golf. It's... Okay, sure. To the next boys. All right, Aaron. Just a couple more shots and I'll be ready for an edit session. Hey, save some film for my beach bash performance. Well, I guess, you know, Brett's being like, I think I'm a Leo because he's into heavy metal, I guess. Video store. Yeah. Aaron's just like, I picked all the shortest things. Virgo, pizza, BMX, mall, R&B. That's it. Just not even trying to do a sentence here. Hey Ryan, dude, you gonna come by and join my dude. skateboard session while my parents have the water out of the pool? Sounds totally cool. Count me in if the waves aren't happening this weekend. Do you think I should read that line again? <laughs> I'm gonna rip into all of them, so... Uh, but he does listen to Alt Rock, that Ryan guy. He's gotta be cool, right? Right? Go, Bobcats, go! Check out this hot new dance routine. I, mm, listen, I don't trust the vegetarians. I'm sorry, guys, but you know that guy's got his initials on his shirt. I'm I'm very certain that's not the school's initials. I'm pretty sure that's just him. He can do a backflip, cool, but I I don't trust it. I don't trust the vegetarian. I'm sorry. And then we're back to this. So we got five groups of boys. Each one has a guy whose name starts with B, and that's very important because. Let's start the game, shall we? Uh, you may remember as well, this game is developed by Endspace, the same developers as both the last game, and that Rugrats game I played last year. Um, <coughs> there's a no sound to run out of ideas, so hurry up and get dressed for school, the bus will be here in just a few minutes. Uh, you proceed to not have Time any... Get ready for school, girls. Like... <laughs> I don't know who this mum character is. To change the character's outfits, you just press the direction. You just I say, know, I don't do like think? what you're wearing. Please come back. And then they awesome. sometimes wear super similar stuff. I like it. You got the green jeans. Works is this, for me. Is this what all kids wear to school? They just like have all these like weird. This one's hot. We do a lot of uniforms here in Australia, so it's kind of weird to like you know wear your own clothes. I'm just awesome. gonna go with the default Girl, stuff because you can you there? can easily tell which one's Mary Kate and which one's Ashley. Which one's which? I got no clue, man. So, <laughs> no way. I'm never going to school. Yeah, okay. There were jeans on. By the way, if you saw in that uh, full motion video demo, there were jeans on the fan. There are no jeans right now. I am disappointed they removed the jeans. Okay, so the screen goes black. We wipe. We've got the Austin Powers font right there. You gotta know that it's Austin Powers. And we're introduced to our plot element of this game. Uh, apparently various people love Mary Kate and Ashley so much that they, they don't even so, look where they're going. So, to Saturday School Beach Bash? I don't know. I'm thinking of buying a new bikini. A new suit, the beach, and boys. Boys! Hey, what's all the commotion over there? I don't know, but it looks like our lockers might be involved. Please don't tell me that Taylor is over there. I'd like to tell you that it's not, but it is. She's probably got some juicy gossip. Let's go check it out. Why would you... Hey, what's up? Okay. Oh, just, Mary just don't Kate. acknowledge Hi, it. Hi, Ashley. 
You guys, I'm so glad you're here. This is terrible. The absolute worst. Oh, the hands clipping. Oh. Well, I did see part the elbows popping off. Sorry, the, the shoulder. Oh. Let's go through the who, what, where, and when. It all happened so quick. One minute, just watch her, no watch her, her, uh, the next, her shoulder well, just Courtney was tearing it into pieces all the way down the hall. This was all I could salvage. I'm afraid it's not of any help. Hmm. Hey, Mary Kate. We hope school be Saturday B. Well, we know it was written to me, and it looks like it might have to do oh, with Oh, that's Mary Kate. There you go. Saturday's big school beach batch. Could it be Brandon? The captain of the football team? No, I have it. What if it's Brett? His videos are the coolest. He films people without their consent. How cool. Says, we hope. That's so not fair. You're so lucky. I can't get one person to ask me, and you got two, maybe more. I've got to go. Wait till everyone hears about this. Why can't I get a date? Maybe I talk too much? No, no, it's my hair. Yep, I'll bet it's my hair. Maybe I should put it up. Definitely talks too much. Oh gosh. Well, looks like the only way do twins do that as well? Do they just casually course. like say yep. the same thing at Let's the same time the all the time? The I think I said this last week as well. This is almost the same plot as last week. Yeah, I mean it doesn't have a magic bangle that pauses time. It's a bit more, a bit more tame. It's just well, we're getting asked by boys. It happens. So uh, behold, there's actually an okay frame rate this time around. Um, now you can see the note. Hey, Mary Kate, we hope school beach Saturday B. It's just the first take trying to read the, the thing. So, uh, you can wander around, but, uh, apparently it's very dark if you try and go in the male, uh, bathroom. Uh, other than that, the rules are basically the same as this game as the other one. And this one I have actually played in the past. Uh, my sister has a physical copy of it, so there you go. Can I help you, Mary Kate? You didn't happen to see Courtney? Uh, no, not today. I hope you and your sister are planning to help with the beach cleanup project. <laughs> okay, so there's a little bit more going on. A little bit. Yeah, but otherwise, the same rules apply. You're walking around. Uh, and then there's going to be just levels. In fact, actually, we've got the freshman hall, and I'm pretty sure the sophomore hall opens up later. And if it doesn't, well, okay, I'm wrong. So we've got a few different. Uh... Sarah, this physics field trip is the highlight of my year. Mine too, Byron. I <laughs> hope we're going to the planetarium again. Oh, that was. Oh my great. gosh, that popping! A trip to the power plant just be neato. Excuse me, you didn't happen to see Courtney? No. But you can check the physics room. <laughs> yeah, Courtney in the physics lab. <laughs> I'll check. Thanks. What's with the popping? I know that popping is there on the, the actual copy as well. So go in and, uh, well, we start a mini game. We are loading physics. That's right. NVIDIA, eat your hearts out. We're doing it ahead of time. No weird outfits this time around. Ashley, there she is. There's Courtney. Let's get her. Whoa, let's think about this. Where do you think this bus is headed? It's a physics club field trip. Do we really want to give up our afternoon for this? We go on this field trip, which leads to Courtney, which leads to a piece of the note. Note plus beach party equals boys. Now that you put it you in gotta do it for the boys. The physics field trip doesn't sound so bad after all. Okay, people, find a seat and simmer down. And, uh, away we go, I guess. Where is she? Ashley, I found her. But she's not going to be able to help us much. Why is that? Where is she? Well, she's out there, and we're here heading for a full day of physics. No! Par apparently... You know, what, what do we encourage Beautiful. girls to do? Hate physics. It is a small tribute to Albert Einstein's brilliant theory of relativity. Did you know that according to Einstein's E equals MC squared theory, it's actually possible to travel through time? Yes, it's true. 
Oh, and another thing. If you're hoping to score a hole in one by sneaking your ball past that swinging pendulum, well, <laughs> timing is everything. So, um, yeah, they brought back the golf from the Rugrats, which granted that was probably the part that was most worthwhile in that game. Uh, the clocks clearly function like clocks should. That is right. You can clearly see, uh, like not the rightmost digit, but the, uh, one to the right of that, you can clearly see it's hitting six at times. Or that's just my screen flickering, one of the two. Point is, it's kind of weird, let's go in, let's do it. It's part two. Other than that, it plays basically the same. You can even hit up, and it just goes whoop. I'm gonna straighten out. I'm pretty sure you can yeah, back out of a swing, go back in. Go, go back in, there we go. Might be other camera angles available. Nope. Oh, there you go, you got, you got a super... Super low angle shot, this is probably the one. Uh, am I going to time it well? Probably not, but we'll see. Uh, I think the goal is to beat the par time. On everything, but eh, it's not the easiest. And then you got to walk it, you got to walk to the next one. At least there's no hidden mummy room this time around. But uh, what's this like extremely abstract like... There we go. I played enough Switch Sports recently. I'm I'm getting pretty good at my golf. So there we go. I got a B. Actually, I think you don't even have to get the par. I think you just have to like be above a C at whatever the game considers by the end. Uh, just like Rugrats, you gotta keep loading all the time. One hole is too intensive. Although it had the outside in memory, so. Uh... This hole speaks volumes about the science of modern communications. Do you know who invented the telephone? Don't say well, his name was Graham. Alexander there Graham Bell, and the discovery of the telephone was made by accident in 1876. Now, if you aim your ball very carefully, your hole in one won't be recorded as an accident. I think it is going to be an accident. I'm just looking at these slopes going, yep. There's like no hope there. I'm really curious actually, like What is like, the, the intended, uh, I don't know, it's very, very abstract, this whole, like, just weird, meshy, you know, kind of mini golf course. I can't even explain it, but it's just, it's a bit bizarre. So let's just go in with a pretty powerful shot to see if I get, oh, nope, I've gone straight past, and now I'm in this kind of rut. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm just looking at this going, yeah, do I go c casual? You can't run. Cause it's like, yeah, you gotta go uphill into a hole. That's never fun for mini golf. Cause this is just gonna roll all the way back down if I get this wrong. You know what? I I I was like, oh no, I just full powered it, and then I'm I'm surprised how low how how far back that just went. Okay, maybe just like. Ah, uh, like... They don't make this easy. They really don't make it easy to, to, to get this one. <laughs> the worst part is that I know all the other minigames are like... Not that bad at all, but it's just... Yeah, well, that's okay. I'm okay going one over, because that's still a C. And you can still bring it back. Um... I just want to note as well, uh, well, when, when this is all over. In this hole, we'll study the physics of action and reaction. And what better place than from within a giant pinball machine? Did you know that for every action, there is a reaction? If you press a ball with your fingers, your fingers are also pressed by the ball. It's all true. All of it, I tell you. Hit any of the pinball's bumpers and you'll witness a major chain reaction. One which could even score you a hole in one. Uh... You know, he's like almost right, but it's like a little bit weird. There's the shopping picture. Actually, that is literally just the last game. That is the Magical Mystery Mall. And the numbers keep going up. They just keep going. Or... Somewhat. Uh, but I just want to note, whoever did the, uh, the retro achievements set, I just want to note here. 
Um, look at these achievement names. It's like, some of these are pretty normal. You know, we'll have an opportunity to take back the note during physics. Like, these are just like, you know, do the, the levels. And then some of them are like, uh, you know, complete a game of mini golf uh, with a grade A total, sure. Get a hole in one. Uh, and then some of these are just like, they demand blood. Courtney will at last pay for her insolence. The end is at hand. I hope you weren't stopping here. Your allegiance has been noted. Farewell for now, human. I don't know, man. Whoever, whoever's been doing these achievement names, they had a lot of fun on this one. Um, as for how to get the hole on this one, I think you just go for it. You just go for the bumper. I mean, it bounces. Oh, 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 oh. Also, if there's one other thing I'm good at, it's Waluigi Pinball. Whoop. So where am I going? I'm going just in there. Except these are like bounces, aren't they? Let me just go like casual into there. Oh. Alright, that's actually set up to get a birdie. As long as I don't like over or underdo it. There we go. Cool! We got the birdie! <laughs> there you go, that was an A. Listen, I suck at getting connected, but pinball? You can't stop me, bro. Can't stop me. Ah. It appears that the designers of this hole were quite an ambitious bunch. You can see that they've actually installed a giant particle accelerator right here on the course. What does a particle accelerator do, you ask? Well, scientists sometimes use these devices to accelerate very small particles to near the speed of light. Now, if you can make it past those energy fields and into the accelerator, well then you'll make your fastest and easiest hole in one yet. Go for it! I feel like they actually put a decent amount of thought into this. Now the only thing is you gotta time this. Cause you're gonna see that like it goes boop, bonk, bonk. Wait, bonk, bonk, bonk. So I'm thinking I probably gotta like do the swing uh, when the second one is going out. And then just like, just deliver it straight forward, okay? There you go. Whoa, look at that, I'm a god. I was thinking like, there's a bit of a delay on the swing, but it's the fourth hole. That was also an A, but sure, okay. As long as you get a C, I'm happy. That's all I care about. C's get degrees. Don't let anyone tell you otherwise. In this hole, you will test Sir Isaac Newton's laws of motion. The conveyor belts in this scooter the factory are sure create plenty of motion. motion. If your ball touches any of the conveyor belts, it will follow in their direction because of the forces of motion they create. Did you know that gravity is also a force of motion? It's true! Now, strategy plays a big part here, so feel free to take a walk around the factory and map out which conveyor belts will deliver your ball right into a hole in one. <laughs> and the best of luck. This is a part two. This is a super mean part two as well because like you just gotta rely on like these things to like close up. I'm pretty certain you want the right one here. And then I don't know, maybe it skips this. If, if you can skip going down here. See, I wish I, I didn't follow the laws of motion. Let's just go for it. Alright, so what are we looking for? Okay, we're just gonna swing forward. Yep, okay, sure, we're going down this one instead. Cool. Oh, now it's a part three. I swear, did it say it was a part two earlier? Am I going crazy? Bonk. Again, if I was going slow enough, that would have gotten in, but that's okay. Well, I guess it's another bogey, but yeah, I'm already two under par, so I think this should do it. 
You know what? Like, you know, they like the mini golf over there at End Space, and that's okay. Oh my gosh. How. <laughs> Good thing I got this camera angle. I don't think it bounces. This I think it's long. It wow, you're really angry about that one. You passed, though. You did it in 14. Oh, her yeah, eyes. Actually? Yeah, and for a physics field trip, it was pretty fun. That was yeah, supposed to take the whole day, apparently. Courtney. Note, is this what you're looking for? Courtney dropped this by me when she was on the bus earlier. Hey, let's see that. I've been trying to decipher it. She's used a very complex encryption technique this time. Byron, I think she... She likes me. I knew it. All those years, all those glaring looks avoiding me in the halls, and now this. She's playing hard to get. Yes, Courtney, my dear, your Byron has broken your code of love. Mary-Kate, let's get back inside. We need to find Courtney before Byron does. No kidding. Byron might chase her out of town before we get the rest of the note. Perfectly hmm. normal behavior. What do you think, Ashley? Okay. Hey, Mary-Kate. We hope... Let... See you... School Beach... Saturday... B. Mary-Kate, we're gonna need more clues. This is the most helpful... Like, no ever. Also, yeah, I, maybe I'm a bit too young to, like, have people, like, share notes like this. And then for also people to tear them up. I never had boys asking me to the, to the school beach. Never happened. Very disappointed. It is probably because I talk too much. So, anyway, we're back in here. Uh, yes, I would like to save my game. Check that memory card. Create that save file. Save that save file. There we go. Uh, you cannot do physics anymore. They have locked the classroom, but that's okay. We've got go team. Hey, Mary Kate, you should try out for the cheerleading squad. Where's the squad. audio coming from? Courtney is. Go through the gym doors over there. Thanks. Courtney's chilling out. Oh, I just hit a wall. I my. <laughs> so try out. More like drop out. That's me. I'm not trying anything. Oh my gosh. Look, there's Courtney. Wow. That looks like a piece of our note. My horoscope did say I'd be lucky today. Let's get it. Well, your horoscope was wrong. What will we do now? I just had a sudden urge to cheer our school team to Ask victory. the teacher. You're trying out for Ask the, the teacher. Keep an eye on that clipboard. If you want to lie, okay, girls, volunteer to recycle it. One position left or on throw it in the spot. trash. Teachers so love that. Best. Oh my gosh, that is the school's initials. Why don't you stretch out while I get set up on the field? Bully high, bully? Okay, let me guess. You think you're gonna beat me out for a spot on the cheerleading squad? Am I close? Well, actually not really. But now that I'm here, making the cheer squad might be really cool too. Well, you'll have to be. That'd be me. kind of insulting that if you chance. lost to that. We'll see. All Just right. like ah, oh, yeah. Hope you're haven't ready. tried, but this is how it's going to work. I'll show you a cheer sequence, and you have to repeat it. Sounds simple, but I'm looking for sharp motions and good timing. I'll pick one of you as the newest member of our squad after we've completed the tryouts. That'll be me. Good luck. You'll need it. And they look so weird. Both of these games. All right, so this is uh, just prep of the rapper, but without the rapping. Right. Left. It's also not really to a rhythm; it just kind of goes. Right. Left. You just gotta build your star power. Up. Down. When did Amplitude come out? Up. Down. But oh. hey. It's, uh, it's lax enough that you don't really have to complain too much other than hitting up immediately when this bar goes all the way. Up. <laughs> Down. Right. Uh, I think the arrows, uh, Left. shows right. who's Left. hitting it and who's not hitting it as well. I, I assume it's a very, like, two-player mode kind of game. Left. Right. Left. I don't think I ever was up. caught playing this two-player. You gotta do spins and kicks. Spin. Kick. Spin. Kick. Spin. 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 You can't even finish spin. it. Kick. Spin. 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 Left. Left. Right. Right. Kick. Kick. 
Just some very bizarre moves. They're not even kicks. Left, left, right, right. Kick, kick, kick. Spin, spin, spin. Now you have to memorize the moves I show. Oh boy, so now, oh boy. What's a girl gotta do to win. Uh, be perfect, I guess. Up, down. All right, here we go. Up, down. Here we go. Can I memorize and commentate? Well, I can barely commentate already, so... It's easy, it's just a rotation. You go down, and you go left, and you go up, and you go right. I don't know if these patterns are random in any way as well. Kick, down, up, jump. X, down, up, triangle. X, down, up, triangle. Here we go. Down, up, Triangle. Good thing Parappa didn't get you to memorize anything. Down, down. Up, down, 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 up, down. up. Up, up. Up, down, down. Da da da. Down, up, up. Be kind of cool if they got the music to line up. X down, down. triangle up. X down, triangle Hit. up. Up. Kick. X down, down triangle. Hit. Up. There we go. Here's something fun. Do the opposite of the move I show you. Now, what is an opposite? What is an opposite of right. X and triangle? I don't know. So left, left right, down, up. up. Down. Right. Left. Left. Right. Up. Down. Down. Up. Sure. Kick. Down. Triangle up. Kick. Up. Triangle. Kick. Spin. Down. Spin. Okay. Yeah, okay, yeah. triangle counts. Kick up, kick, spin, down, spin, spin. Kick up. This up. does take like undoing your brain for a moment. Kick up, 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 down, kick, spin, kick, up, down, kick, spin, kick, left. left oh my gosh, right. it keeps going, it keeps going. Spin. Oh my gosh. Up, down. Left, right, left, right, left, right. Up, down, up, down, left, right, left, right, left, right. I think I actually got okay, the achievement. Girls, great job. <laughs> Let me get the scores together and I'll be over there in a sec. Oh, I wonder who won. Not bad, Mary Kate, but I still think the spot on the squad is mine. Like, why do we Help care? Me. Here comes Nikki. Well, girls, you both worked real hard, but unfortunately, we can only take one of you. So we decided neither. And the one we selected is... Mary-Kate, congratulations! I won! I won! <laughs> one new cheerleader, and one new part of the note. It, again, could have asked the teacher for the note on that one. Hey, Ashley, this new clue might interest oh, you. Oh, they wrote Let's two see. with a number. Oh, who does that? Hey, Mary-Kate, we hope... Too long to ask, but would you two like to hang out? Actually, the two is okay. They're missing a would. Hmm. Sorry, two? would you two like to... Oh, Meaning my me? brain. Let... See you... School Beach... Saturday... B. My brain can't comprehend anymore. Let's find more. That's what this game's done. It's already turned my brain to mush. I'm, I'm probably over overreacting, but it is kind of like, yeah, you know, it's a, it's a game for, for, for young kids. Am I being too harsh on it? Maybe. You know, it's a little fun little mini game collection kind of game. Doesn't need to be really too, too fancy. Definitely, I mean, it runs a lot better than the previous one, it, and it's certainly got more going on. Like, at least, there's two games, but you can't run on paper. You still can't run on paper. Um... Uh, well, Mr. Bones isn't happy. Okay, so I guess we've walked over in this corner enough. Did they just... Ah, yes, the sophomores are now open. We can now conduct... Oh, hi, Ashley. Hi. Have any of you seen Courtney? <laughs> staring I'm at the sorry. wall. Check out some of the classrooms in this hall. <laughs> so, uh, we got f journalism. Oh. I, I walked into something for a moment. 
Here they are. The <laughs> I feel like they're younger in the game than they actually are at this point. Like, they're probably like 16 now? They're definitely older. Oh, great. Glad you two oh, I by. never trust people Another with this kind of haircut, especially in the year 2001. Estimate yearbook? Right. Well, uh, Mr. White, we were just. Oh, and he's Mr. White. Cameras and film. It's all right over there, people. But, but you don't understand. We can't. I know you can't get all the shots at once, Ashley. But you know we're on a tight deadline, so just shoot the pictures for each photo assignment and get them back to me before the bell rings. Make it happen, people. Okay. Uh, sure. We won't let you down, Mr. White. Literally, just tell Let's the teacher go. you have oh, something else to do, considering you we'll won't really you sign up to do it. Oh my gosh, point. can you just... Oh. Great plan. Picture perfect plan. Well, it gives us a photography minigame, so... Oh, still need shots of Tony, the drummer, practicing for halftime by the stadium doors. Curtis Fox, the basketball star, hanging out with the freshman hall. And then Mr. Sheen, the janitor, trying to keep Bully High spotless. Alright, so you're looking for a drummer, you're looking for a basketball star, you're looking for a janitor. Can you read the instructions again? Nope. Hey, Jessica, have you, um, got a date to Saturday's Big Beach Bash? No, not yet. Why? Well, I, um, thought you, you know, might be interested in going with me. Sure, that would be totally cool. Excuse Say me. Cheese. Curtis was over in the freshman hall. Thanks. I don't think this is the guy. No? Okay. So, no drama. No drama yet. Oh, now I can see the assignments again. Okay, cool. I'm glad. Oh, good thing we got a map. Why don't I just look up the map? The map makes it so much easier. Okay, uh... Looking for a drama. Where's the drum? Oh, oh, I wonder where the drummer is. Say cheese. Too far. Oh, excuse me. Say cheese. Okay. Oh, we good. We're good. Cool. Okay. He's, he's coming out with the drums. Uh, you're not keeping anything spotless. Don't care. You're keeping stuff spotless. Smile. I feel like this is a bit of a like poor you. caricature, but. That's okay. How about an action shot, Mary Kate? Uh, I already got the action shot, and also you're blocking the way. Come on, man. You know what? At least it's a little more involved than the other. Uh... Oh man, <laughs> who's the basketball player? Thanks for the help. There you go. Uh, at least it's a bit more involved than the other photo game. You know, you get to walk around, actually know who you're taking target or pictures of. And you only have to find them, you don't actually have to, you know, guess that they're in the shot correctly and have terrible pointing systems kick in. Awesome. I did, I got the photos. Let me off the hook, please. Nope. You gotta load more. You gotta load more, so... Yeah. Uh, so anyway, I guess uh, in the past week, uh, we had the Game Awards happen, and... Um, I came up with a, uh, oh, so there's a guy doing detention, uh, biology class guy, uh, the principal, and librarian. Okay. You gotta watch out for the spills and ills. Kinda weird as well that they just open up more of the school. Like, what is it exactly? Is it even loading? I assume. Now, Ashley, don't go putting me on the cover and all. Oh. Here you go. You are the star of the Yay. show. Cool shot. Cool. Um, but yeah, the Game Awards happened. Um, I feel like that's the obvious joke of, uh, you know, Bill Clinton winning the awards. Uh, I feel like that's been spoken of to death. Uh, but what I wanted to, to kind of mention was that uh, out of 23 awards that went to games, only, or 10 of them went towards either Elden Ring it's photo time. Oh my gosh, he's actually called Mr. Bones as well. Do I have to... Yeah, that is... Cute I'm gonna have to take a picture with Mr. Bones. There you go, man. Cool shot. There you go. Uh, 
But yeah, 10 of the awards went to Elden Ring or God of War Ragnarok, uh, with four awards and six awards respectively, uh, although not Game of the Year for God of War. Um, I kind of had a bit of a step back and went like, why is it that both of these games are being nominated for Game of the Year kind of stuff? Because I'm thinking like, not everyone out there even likes those kinds of games. And I'm thinking, perhaps the biggest issue the with- The whole idea of homework, Billy, is to take it home and do it. Pose. Hey, do you mind? This is exactly what you put in the yearbook. Oh, excuse me. Sorry, I need to center the principal. All right. Not the not the guy who's getting told off. Okay. Um, but, uh, yeah, I, I'm thinking, like, yeah, a lot of the games that get nominated for the tops of various categories are action-y kinds of games. And I know that you get those, like, kinds of, you know, video essay kind of people who are like, oh, games can be art, and then they, like, only talk about walking sims. And then it's like, no, the games can be so much more action-y. And then they only... For helping Billy. Next stop, the big house. The big... Oh, my gosh. Go to jail. Oh, excuse me. Face the camera, you fool. Cool. He's got some real bizarre proportions, let me tell you that. Like, his waist is like... Three quarters of his... Body just keeps going down, oh my gosh. Um... So, uh, but... Yeah, like, uh... That is, I mean, that is a... That is a math equation, but that E equals MC squared is a very science thing. Did I just unload... Like, that like, corridor there? Very weird, but okay. Um... But yeah, I feel like the Game Awards might be a very, like, odd representation of, or a very, like, media-represented, like, view of gaming. And not necessarily what people are actually playing or what you yourself are interested in. I would say the cool. best outcome for the Game Awards would be you discover games that you've never heard of before and you go, oh, you know, that'd be something nice to play. But unfortunately, I found that most categories were the same games in fact even and and i i even said this before the category for best community support is the same five games that it was last year the category for best ongoing game has four out of the five games from last year and both in last year and this year both categories went to final fantasy 14. i'm like that's a pointless category not because final fantasy 14 doesn't deserve it but that like you know we got to give two awards to final fantasy 14 when, uh, like, there are a lot of games that need to be, well, not need, but, like, there are a lot of games that can be mentioned, but there's just not a category for them. And then we try to prop up, you know, best ongoing game, and it's like, well, of course it goes to just the game that's consistently doing well. So here we go. Sarah and Vanessa are practicing for the talent show in the sophomore hall. Find Heather at the copy in the administration office. Uh, the freshman math teacher preparing for class. And the driver's ed teacher goes off-roading through sophomore hall. Well, this is sophomore hall, so let's just see if, you know, any open classrooms. Not the chocolates guy, right? Nope. How or about donuts. a donut, Mary Kate? Could you help me? Don't know about all them, but I did see Sarah and Vanessa around here. Thanks. Could, could you help me? No, no, don't know. Here they go. They're going. Say cheese. They're grooving. Great shot. Cool. Okay. It give you a lot of time to take all these photos, though. Oh, that's what they meant by his off-roading. I think I need to take a picture of him, so... Kind of, like, front it on, because apparently... Action shot of the car on the side is, uh, not good enough. Um, but yeah, I, I was thinking, like, you know what? Like, there are people out there who Pictures. may... Sure, Smile. let me who... get my will work for food sign. There are people out there who probably Thanks dig a lot of sports games, and even if it's just like, oh, I really enjoyed the new F1, or the new Gran Turismo, or the new NBA, or stuff like that. You get one category where you all get to fight over. Same thing with simulation, um, and there's bound to be games as well that don't even get mentioned in various categories. I'm here playing Switch Sports, I'm having a good time with it. Is it necessarily the greatest game of the year? Heck no, but it's something that I feel like, you know, is good fun. I don't know what's going on here, but sure, okay. I'm gonna assume the other two are... You know, or well, the administration office is like halfway. Um, but yeah, I like perhaps what should be done, rather, is various people kind of highlight what were the most fun things that they've done in games in the past. Can you come back later, Mary Kate? Okay, act 
natural. Oh my gosh, how do you how do you get a, a good shot on this one? Say cheese. Yeah, like how do, how do you face the camera? Ooh. Maybe I'll, I'll just come back later. Follow their their heed their instructions. So we're going to the, the math class, or as uh, everyone in, in the rest of the world calls it, maths, with an S. What is going on here? Oh, he's sweeping the floors. Really made you walk the long way to get to math class. They didn't really design the school very well for, uh... Who would play this without the map? Like, how would you, how would you even understand where you're going? Excuse me, teacher! How about a shot of me writing tomorrow's homework assignment? Say cheese! There is Have something nice wrong with that face, man. Worst part is if they're actually based on real people and it's not just some artist painting it. I'm sorry, but it's also 2001. And I know it's like, well, it's the PS1, but it's like... Oh boy, it just... <laughs> it's just very weird looking. GTA 3 was out this year, and I guess GTA 3 didn't have the most real, realistic people, but... Well, at least their faces didn't look as munted as they do right now. Alright, I'm gonna hope you cleaned it up. You did not clean it up. Now I gotta spend the efforts trying to take a photo here. Say cheese. I'm gonna hope you just turn left. Is that good enough? How did... All right, just, just turn this way, bro. Turn this way. Nope. Stop interacting with the machine and turn this way. Nope. Stop interacting with the machine and turn this way. You just gotta, you just gotta look in this direction. Oh, now you look. When I fall over. When I fall over. Now you do it. Okay, cool. I did a low angle shot. We'll accept it. Submit it. Lock in an Eddie. Got your stupid pictures. This is what you get for writing a yearbook late. Everyone right, does it. Ashley, we got all the pictures. Yeah, but no sign of Courtney. Or the note. We're running out of time. Note? Courtney? What's going on, girls? Nothing. We're just looking for Courtney. No, no don't nothing it. Well, Courtney was just here to drop off her photography project and camera and... And... And you might be interested in this torn piece of paper that was stuck to one of the pictures. Yes! Look, Ashley! It's another part of our note! Thanks, Mr. White. We'll give you the full scoop when we figure it out ourselves. She would have done better to Good just, luck, like, girls. dip them in Thanks water or something. Instead of, like, bringing them around to various people. Hey, Mary-Kate. We hope too long to ask, but would you, too, like to hang out? Let us know. Hope it's yes. See you. School Beach. Saturday. B. It's yes, but who are you? <laughs> My ears, the popping. Yeah, so, yeah, I feel like, you know, th there are more experiences out there, and I also wouldn't say that a game getting Game of the Year even particularly means a ton. It means a bit, but it's also kind of like, I don't really know if any of these categories were real huge mysteries beyond how, how did it Genshin Impact win the player's voice again? Especially after we removed the bot votes, you know? Like, oh, okay. Um, other than that, lots of ads. Uh, there's still no more PlayStation 5 exclusives, because uh, Steam's getting two of them. Uh, so here we have history. Apparently no one is going to tell us, you know, who is history. But sure, we shall history. Please don't let this be another field trip. Ashley, there's Courtney. With the Courtney. Courtney? No way. Okay, everyone. In case you haven't figured it out, I'll be substituting for Miss Washington today. Miss She's Washington. instructed me to have you pick partners for your final projects. And take you to World Wonders Miniature Golf for a different perspective on history. Yay. So, before you board the bus, write your name and your first choice for a partner on a piece of paper and put them in the box. Okay, that's cheating I'll for twins. I'll announce the teams after we come back. Courtney, how about coughing up the rest of our notes? 
Oh, sure, Mary Kate. Oops. So sorry. Okay, she can clearly hear that. that one. See you at the links. What will we do now, Mary Kate? Golf anyone? That's right. That's right. We got more mini ah, golf. History. One of the essential building blocks to a thorough education. Speaking of building blocks, did you know that the Great Pyramid in Egypt is nearly 50 stories high? Builders used almost 2.3 million stone blocks to build the Great Pyramid, each one weighing an average 5,000 pounds. Luckily, you're not there to build any pyramids. Your task is quite simple, really. Send your ball into that pesky little hole. Why not give it a try? A <laughs> pesky little hole? There are three holes. And which one which one goes the right way? They've just mystery metered. Also, yeah, hold on, wait, we've got another desert level. Oh, that's actually a mystery meet. Like hole anyways. Yeah, there's no there's no like weird mummy like room in this, I don't think. I'm gonna hope there's no mystery mummy room, but also like, yeah, uh there's um there's two pyramids. There's two pyramids. I guess there's also the two pyramids over there. Like you got the one over there and then... I don't know what's going on man, this is this is a map and a half. Well, you can, I guess you can only exit the level so... Well, we'll give it a go. We'll give it a go. Do we go straight forward or do we try and lean right? Let's try and lean right. This will be fun. This is not fun. <laughs> Do we just abandon ship or commit? I'm gonna commit. Oh no, I'm not. Oh, this is how I regret hard. Um. Listen, I had a plan, and you guys didn't believe in me, and now you you know, I'm laughing. You're not laughing. <laughs> the tornado the tornado apparently that's sure this happened in history okay you gotta accept it what were they thinking when they built this place aliens i don't know looks rather strange doesn't it though the true purpose uh, of stonehenge like... is still a subject of debate many believe that the prehistoric rock formation was created to serve as a simple daily calendar others feel that stonehenge is the work of aliens there you Do go you? Watch the rock formations of Stonehenge carefully, and you may spot a clear path to the hole. Clear path? What do you mean? Okay. It's just... Oh, no. <laughs> this is exactly what Stonehenge was designed to do. I'm very certain that was my clear path. Alright, let's just... Go. Oh, my God. Next round I swear I hit the very, very first one. I swear. <laughs> There you go. There you go. Why did I do too many golf courses? I don't know. But I'm not complaining. It's it's more exciting than a you know fashion show. Our next stop is at the Great and Wall China, Dash. which was built by the Ming Dynasty in the 15th and 16th centuries. The Great Wall stretches an amazing 1,500 miles along China's northern border. Did you know that the Great Wall is not a single continuous wall? No, it isn't. It actually consists of many walls and towers that leave open passages in various places. A heavy smack to your ball should send it ricocheting towards its next destination. Good luck! Oh boy, I'm gonna give my ball a heavy smack. Um, let's just go down this way, let's see how it goes. Okay, that was atrocious. That was atrocious. That was real bad. Was this part four? Uh, listen, it's got analog support, but it doesn't. It's it's got the vibration, so it's clearly got support specifically for the Dual Shock. Because remember, the PlayStation One had the Dual Analog before the Dual Shock, so Rumble was a a later feature than that, but this is also 2001. It's kind of like everyone's expected to just have, you know, rumble. Uh, I think we're easy pickings. 
Easy pickings. Again, this is a really abstract hole. I'm just like, I'm actually on the Great Wall. And there's the ground right there, and it just kind of cuts off. It, it, it's just a gap right there. They're just like, yeah, no one's gonna care that we're just seeing the edge of the world. There we go. Do that default dance, yeah. Bab. On to the next hole. This is just a mini golf game. This is the whole reason why I wanted to play these, just to play mini golf. Here we have a faithful recreation of the Mayan ruins found in Tikal, Guatemala. Oh, uh, someone the warned them they've only got 11 years left. Simply breathtaking. Don't you agree? You're breathtaking. The Mayan civilization is responsible for many of the beautiful stone pyramids, temples, and sculptures that have been discovered throughout present day Mexico, Guatemala, Honduras, and El Salvador. All places they once lived long ago. The object of this course is as mysterious as the Mayans themselves. Aim for one of the smaller temples and your ball will magically transport itself towards the hidden hole. The hidden hole. Yep, hole four. Well, this is what they mean by the, the hidden temples, the ones off to the side here. I don't know if this is gonna work. We'll see. Wow, that's kind of pointless, isn't it? You gotta walk it, and then it's like, wait. Well, I guess, I guess this could work. It's a very particular, like, angle though. I wish I didn't have to deal with the analog. Okay, here we go. Oh, really? Really? Uh, do I have the angle? Nope. You like how that froze for a moment? The game was like, oh, should it go in? Nope. Nope. Not today. Well, this is this is where I, I hurt my score. I just fang it. Well, I'm off by one. That's okay. Tried my best. <laughs> you tried your best and your best wasn't good enough. What's kind of weird as well is that, uh... It only clicked in for me just now. I was like, oh yeah. I am technically switching characters between the holes. I cannot even tell. Congratulations, you've reached the Atlantic Ocean. The Atlantic oh, is I've the been there. largest of our planet's four oceans. On October 12th, 1492, while in search of a direct sea route from Europe to Asia, Christopher Columbus unintentionally discovered the Americas. Quite a lucky fellow, that Columbus. Check to see which of the ocean's currents <laughs> will sail you. Quite a lucky fellow, that journey. Columbus. Very lucky fellow. This is a par two. Like, I mean, you know, I like my Pokemon, you know, gyms and dungeons as much as the next guy, but I cannot tell you where the dragon just like doesn't work. I want the dragon to eat me. Oh, okay, because you can't, oh, okay. Well, very adorable dragon. We need a dragon in every single, like, you know, pool. Again, this is also just like, you know, you're like a giant or something. Walking on the ocean like it's nothing. Bermuda Triangle right there. All right, let's fang it. Let's see where we go. Oh, I didn't really get the current to carry me over. But that's okay. Because I'm pretty sure if I just kind of like lightly nudge it in there, it should be swept. Cool. Alright, so I nearly got sucked into a vortex, and now I gotta swing it upstream. Oh my god, I'm a god. I'm a god. I think that put me right on par, so that's actually... Oh, well, one over. There's still a B. It's still a B. 
and our last two teams are Mary Kate and Ashley. And wow. Hmm. Strange. Oh, uh, and let's see, Byron and Courtney. Oh. oh, Courtney, do you believe in destiny? Don't you worry about a thing. I'll schedule and plan out the whole project. This is what she gets for not writing her own. She can't even get back Looks in. Looks like Courtney has more problems than just keeping that note from us. I don't know. Byron and Courtney forever? Kind of has a ring to it. Yeah, like a fire alarm. <laughs> Let's get the note. <laughs> that, was, that was a one-person laugh. They, she laughed at her Ashley, own joke. Just as you thought. This letter's for you, too. Here. Hey, Mary-Kate and Ashley. We hope we haven't waited too long to ask, but would you two like to hang out? Let us know. Hope it's yes. See you. School Beach, Saturday B. Oh my gosh, we both have dates to the Beach Bash. If you don't mind, I'm going to contain my excitement till we find out who wrote this note. I, I would love if it's just like at the end, it's just instead of B, it's like B, Mary Kate and Ashley. It's from them. They asked each other out. Easy. That's how, that's, that's how you do it. That's how you get a date. Oh, sure, yeah, save your game, so. But yeah, as we, uh, as we approach the end of the year as well, it's, uh, still wonderful times for reflection, and, uh, what better way to reflect than to... Hey, Vanessa, are you and Curtis going to the Beach Bash? Yes, it should be really cool this year. Brandon and I are doing a double date thing. Anyone I know? Excuse me, do you know where Courtney is? I saw her earlier by the history classroom. I, I, I've been to history, bro. I gotta go to marine biology. <laughs> we Marine biology didn't exist until it was loaded in. So hopefully it's not another field trip. This will be the third field trip I've been on all day. Hi, have any of you seen Courtney? No, but her name's on the list. What list? Oh, this is a sign-up sheet for the student volunteers that have already headed down to the beach. The beach? Yeah, the storm we just had yeah. was a huge mess. Everyone on this list is part of the animal rescue and cleanup mission. And of course, you get to get out of school too. Sounds like Courtney. Oh my Let's gosh. Well, Ashley, we're here, but I don't see any signs of Courtney. Yeah, it looks <laughs> like it's barely any you, signs of life. Me, and a beach full of trash. Ahoy there, girls! Look, Ashley, it's Mr. Warden. I'm glad miss him? you two could join us. We've got a lot of work to do. We're ready to help. By the way, do you know where Courtney is? Yeah, I, I know where the other cove is. I, I'm heading over there right now. Go ahead and get started with the cleanup here and get the animals back in the ocean and pick up the trash scattered around the beach. Uh, I'll, I'll be back to pick you up shortly. Oh, okay. What about Courtney? It's no use, Mary Kate. He can't hear us. Let's get this place cleaned up and hope for better luck over at the next club. I think she put an L in that word there. <laughs> so get all the animals back in the water and clean up all the trash before time runs out. That's right. Okay, got it. Just pick up a lot of animals. You got five inventory spots. Walk on over. Press X. Pop them all in. Easy enough, right? Just oh, got to deal with the tank controls, but okay, got it. Sure, okay. Well, it's not even tank controls. It's just weird D-pad controls. Oh, and you can't you can't drop them. Don't drop the crabs. Okay, got it. It's very very important. You do not throw crabs everywhere. So, yeah, this is, a. Uh, listen, this is, uh, at least it's better than Dyna Dash. I'll just say that, so. Um, but yeah, I think it's good to, to reflect back on um, things that you've seen or experienced or whatever in the year. Whether it's games you've played, whether it's music you listen to, movies you watch, uh, things you've done, people you've talked to. I, I'm pressing X going, why can't I throw the crabs in the bin? My mom used to always say that, like, you know, 
flush like things down the toilet, they end up at Bondi. Yeah. Bondi is the, the beach, and it's just like, yeah, um, yeah, I feel like it kind of encouraged me to flush maybe too many, too many bad things down the down the toilet. Bonk. All right, well, there's a crab up here. Where's the last remaining goodie? Oh, it's a can. Pick up that can. Here we go, so, uh... Okay, got it. So I've got my How Long to Beat open on another page. I'm just gonna give it, like, a, a glance over. I feel like there were a lot of games that, uh... You got them all! Yeah, you thought this was it, so... Uh, there's definitely a handful of games that, um, I would like to kind of play through again, maybe on stream. There are some that I play for the first time. Um, some of the more impressive ones that I found okay, were- Okay, girls. You did such a great job in the other cove. We've given you an area that needs a little extra attention. Thanks, Principal Warden. We're glad to be able to help. By the way, you didn't happen to see Courtney? <laughs> oh yeah. It, it, it seems oh, yeah. she thought this was a field trip to the beach. So she went back to the school? Oh no. She was around here when I left to pick you two up. Don't worry, she's not going anywhere. The buses don't come to pick everyone up till next period. Okay, well, we'll get started and hopefully we'll bump uh, There are like time. 15 periods in the school. Mm. Too many euphemisms, too many. So, uh, look at that, we gotta do it all over again. This time there is paper. You have to throw the paper in the paper bin. That turtle is perfectly fine chilling. But the paper goes in the paper bin, so... Another thing to kind of get in the way. Other than that, it's... it's the beach. Uh... Gets a kind of... Oh well, yeah, okay, that's paper, I guess. It's kind of iffy going in the cave, though. I don't know, your frame rate's not liking it. Crabs. This is water. No, it's not. It's that doesn't count as water, apparently. Turtle, turtle, turtle. You're fine, turtle. All right, chuck the paper in there. Lots of bottles. Uh, your guess is as good as mine. Where the? Oh, there it is. That's the bottle bin. Blue crab. I think blue crab is evil. Don't touch the blue crab. He's coming for you. He's coming for you. Oh, now I'm picking up the turtles. Oh, because the turtle is three things. Gosh, why are turtles so big? Oh, the turtles are freshwater as well. That's what I think. So it's like you gotta you gotta go over here. I don't know, they they've got the help, I guess. It's a lot less like necessary in this game, because you're not like questioning what what your life decisions are anymore. You're just kinda going for it. Nope. Where does the turtle go? Does the turtle not go on the beach? Oh, okay, the turtle goes on the beach. Sure. Well, I'm gonna get the turtle. Oh, that turtle went flying. Uh, but yeah, I think uh, there were a couple of things that I found pretty impressive with just like the games that I tried pushing myself to playing this year. Uh, one of the earlier ones I did play was Dark Souls. Um, just kind of interesting to, to play that. Um, I play Resident Evil on stream as well, so that was good fun because that's a game that I probably would have never played. A uh, couple of FPSs that um, some of you may have heard of, some of you may have not. I played Tron 2.0 and... Um, uh, what is this? Mad Space to Hell and Beyond. That was an interesting one. I am running low on time. It's these turtles, man. Oh, I'll just skip the turtle. Go for the paper. All right. Okay, okay, quick, quick, quick. This is really cutting it fine, isn't it? It's probably because I'm, I'm going super inefficient on the turtles. Oh my gosh, because I don't like picking up. So they actually just don't like the water. Oh, now they do. Alright, last turtle. Eh. Oh. oh. 
I gotta. It's, no, I just, just drown myself. Just can't, throw it in there. Oh, dang it, sir. Um, I also pushed myself to play. Uh, what was it? 13's another shooter. Illusion of Gaia. I usually never play too many RPGs. Um, and there were a few that I uh, uh, that I also replayed, and I was like, oh, these are super good fun. And I'm glad I got to replay them. Um, so uh, I played Harvester again. I played, uh, I just see Theme Park World. It's like, oh, no, I played Theme Park World again. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so long, my animals. Oh, there you go. Turtles don't belong in the in a pen. All right. So what's with the water over here? Like it's. Oh. This camera is super fun to deal with because like you can't just put them in here. That doesn't count. Oh well. You know, All right. Find his right. keepers. In the sense of I'm um, throwing things in the ocean. Uh, what's some other ones? Uh, I also gave Metropolis Street Racer another replay. That was good fun. There we go. Chuck him in there. Turtle. Uh, I finally put in the effort and actually Later. beat Paper Mario. Later. That was good fun. Uh, Played Stuart Little 2. Why did I even do that? Oh well. Uh, I figured out how to speedrun oh, Rayman 2, and that one might be fun for a later stream. You know, redeem myself. Um, and uh, yeah, at the beginning of the year as well, I remember I, I uh, put in the effort and finally did a 100% run of Dragon Quest 9, which is uh, a feat only mere mortals can comprehend. Uh, I am concerned because, like, there are eight items left. There's a turtle there. There's another one right there. Did I pass? I think I passed the turtle in the tunnel. So, okay. Time should be on my side. Time should be on my side, but still, it's just like, mm. You know, this is awkwardly cutting it close. This is really awkwardly cutting it close, so... Um, yeah, I don't think I've got really any other ones to note, um, other than, uh, oh yeah, bat- oh, you can't even put him in that. That's not, it's not salt water, it doesn't count. Um, oh yeah, the Asterix game on, uh, the GBA. The one that's just in 3D for some reason. You know the one. <laughs> it's just, oh, okay. So I'm pretty sure there was a turtle that I passed on the way. Oh wait, no, I, I just dropped some some mail. Oh. Oh my gosh. Oh. You, you've you've got to be kidding. You've got to be kidding. You've got to be kidding. The, the mail is clipping the wall. I can't pick it up. This is harder than it looks. You, <laughs> End space. How dare you do this? You are making... You've made me fail the marine biology level twice now. You have... What? Why? Why did? Why do you make me suffer? All right. At least the baseline changed. Whoa! 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 Oh my gosh! I will gladly dispose Later. of this video game. Spot is that newspaper is on kelp. I think you can walk. I think that's the trick. They don't explain it. The only thing that you, you've got is uh, you gotta remember that the Rugrats game also did it. Where it's like if you walk on this, you don't slip on it. Maybe I should have been doing that for the uh, the photocopy of stuff earlier. Oh well. This is a this is a hundred percent of video game, so 
But yeah, uh, it's kind of good just going through like, you know, right. your backlog of things, uh, you know, stuff you've cleared. Just kind of go like, hey, what were the kinds of trends that you, you did through the year? And for me, I'd say the biggest thing for me is, um, you know, definitely stepping out of my comfort for just the kinds of genres I play. Even though, like, none of them are really, like, too weird. Um, I feel like just, you know... There are things that I have yet to experience. I even experienced it a bit with uh, with music. I was just like, hey, you know what? Like, I'm gonna listen to some bands I've never really listened to, Later. some kinds of genres uh, that aren't like, you know, particularly big for me. And then it's like, you know what? Like, I really dig Opeth. I really dig XTC. I really Later. dig uh, Talk Talk. Like, there's a lot of um, Tears for Fears. Another one where it's just like, yeah, like, you know, I knew of them. I didn't really know much about them, and then I listened to them and, and really kind of started to understand. I was like, oh, you know, I'm glad that I, I've sat down and really, like, you know, listened to these kinds of bands rather than, you know, kind of dismiss them and stick with the creature comforts. Uh, but I think it's also good to relive the creature comforts and kind of re understand them as well. So I definitely say, yeah, if you've got like a collection of things that you've listened to, just, you know, Give it a re-listen, or give it a re-replay, re-watch, or anything. You know, don't have to consume new meter all the time. Okay, I've got 50 seconds, I don't know where the things were, because that area seems pretty clear. And the camera is not resetting, there is still the giant enemy crab. I want to say, yeah, there was a turtle here. And then a crab, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, uh, uh. Down. What exactly happens when you, like, fail? Like, what is that? The, the teacher just comes by. Oh, there's a crab over there. F. You're never going back to school again. <laughs> Who knows? Courtney! Oh, it's only you two. I thought you were Warden. He just dropped us off here to help clean up. And I can see why. Yeah, Courtney, it's a nice day for a tan, but aren't you supposed to be helping? Me? Pick up trash? Please. Uh, yeah, but crabs what, are not trash. You don't rat on crabs me, are friends. and I'll give you a piece of that silly note. Maybe she's had okay. enough with crabs. You got a deal. Just don't disappear or we'll sing like canaries. No problem. Later. You're blocking my son. Ciao. Ah. Uh. Ashley, I sure hope this date is worth it. So, yeah. Look at that it. time limit. Six minutes twenty. I'm gonna put thirty objects back in the water. This is actually like. Real talk. If I ever did, like, kind of, you know, this kind of drop-off business... I don't know, man. It just doesn't seem like the most interesting representation of it. It feels like it'd be a great, like, social, you know, moment. You, you hang out with a bunch of mates. You clean up a beach. Sure. I am on the other side of the, riv the river. On the great side of the river. Let's pop that bottle back in. Oh. Hi, there's a bottle. Yes. I'm gonna assume you can walk out in this direction and pop something in this ocean. There you go, look at that. Oops. Now, I might eat my words in five minutes, but currently right now the time limit does not seem that, that, uh, that dangerous. Oh, gosh. <laughs> yes, that is a stingray. The stingray is just casually perusing the ground. He's having a having this fun time. Uh, oh, I guess finding the ocean is probably the tricky bit later on. And the stingrays everywhere. Jeez, man. Oh my gosh, what is going on here? I think they've actually put all the paper localized in one area. Got it. This 
Stingray. Oh, got it. He's going, he's shuffling. Yeah. Well, that wasn't too bad to pick up all the paper there. And then uh, I feel like there's just a lot in the other kinds of corridors I didn't go in. I don't know about you, but... I got four minutes to do nine One more. Down. Again, it doesn't feel like it's uh, too much of a push right now. I might be wrong in a moment, but we'll see. So that's all walled off. Can't go in that direction. Too many trees. They did say there was a big storm, I guess, so... Alright, here we go. Crab. That was not a crab, that was a bottle. The first thing I picked up. More bottle. I just want to turn the camera that way. Like, how... How impossible was it to, to just do, like, regular old camera controls? Like, there's not even, like... Left and right. I think the stingrays are things you gotta pick up. I think the stingrays might be things you pick up. Well, let's try and pick them up in a moment. Hold on. Pop okay, in there. Got it. Stingray. Oh, got it. Yep, nope. Stingrays you pick up. At least you can put two of them in your inventory. Yes. So long, Stingrays. Steve Owen is the that away. I knew it was the Olsen twins the whole time. Never trusted them. Stingray casually, casually waddling. I, real, real talk by the way, never handle a stingray. Just, just don't. Don't do it. Uh, yeah, um, I've got three minutes left and the last stingray is right here. Actually, yeah, what was with the time limit on the second one? Maybe they just didn't play test the game, they just copy pasted and all, yeah, it's fine. Like, it weren't even, the turtles weren't even that bad, it's just, yeah, okay. I'll just accept it. I just accept it, you know. Principal Warden, we're all done. Yeah, I know. I just took Courtney over to the break area. She was telling me how she's gotten everyone here working like a team. The way she was sweating, it looked like she was slaving away in the sun the whole day. Like she said, there's no I in team. Yeah, she's right about that. There's no I in team. There's no Courtney either. Oh, uh, yeah. This is real what dialogue. Someone says if they, wanna, if they don't want to, if they don't want to get, sounds great. you know, sure. disciplined at school. Cleaning up this last area, and then we'll all head over for a break. The buses will be there too. Sounds good. We'll get busy. Although I don't know how we're going to manage without Courtney's help. That's right. We got four phases. Five hundred seconds. That is correct. Eight minutes twenty to pick up. 35 objects. Let's see if I can do it in half the time. I really thought this was engaging enough to do in four games. Is that a snake? Got it. That is just an actual fish. I, I've just caught a fish. Uh, where is the ocean? Barracuda. There we go. So I guess overall, so far, uh, this game is... I mean, it's better than the last one. It lacks the snowboarding, but it makes up with double, you know, mini golf. And I'm kind of torn, because it's like, well, the mini golf is fine. It's not like... Crazy amazing, but it's like, yeah, it works. Later. And you get 10 holes, I guess. So, you're not skimping out on mini golf content. But, uh, I feel like, and especially compared to maybe contemporaries. Oh, actually, I've never played really um, right. a golf game from this era. Um, I've played, uh, like, uh, was it Lynx 2004 on the Xbox? And that one was like remarkably solid. I was not expecting a golf game to have that much content. Um, 
I guess it's also like, you know, it's a it's a later Xbox title. But still, I think that there's, you know, there's merit to be there. Uh, I feel like it's easier to go forward because the ocean would be not right here. Dang it. Dang it, me going for half the time is really pushing it right now. It might be better if I just go for the, um, go for the paper. Later. <laughs> One down. Who's, who's like, oh yeah, turtle. Later. <laughs> Get out of my face, turtle. All right. Oops. All right. Whose papers are these? Oh. Is it worth chasing it like this, or you're never gonna catch up to it? You're never gonna catch up. See, now I'm gonna get super lost because I just walked around in a circle for a while. Let's see, we got we got my mantas. Got my mantas. Let's pop them in the ocean. Should be like here, and then right, left. There we go. The crab really wants, really wants a moment. Uh, oh, I guess one thing, um, some people might be wondering, what's the, the schedule for next week? Uh, the plan is, uh, maybe, decently certain. What I wanted to do, hopefully, was, uh, kind of build, you know, set up the new computer components, um, before this stream, really, but, uh, well, I'm expecting a bunch of, well, I was expecting a bunch of deliveries. One of them came this morning. Not even this morning, came actually this afternoon. So it's just like, eh, you know, like, you can't really build it before, before uh, the stream um, that quick. I'm not that good, that is. Oh, well, this is pretty much where all the rest of the stuff is. Let's just hope that the ocean's over here. There we go. Well, Later. alas, I didn't get half the time, but I think that's plenty of time to get the last few fishies. Got it. They had to know. They had to know that like this just involves a bunch of weird backtracking, right? Pop the fishies in the water. Uh, but yeah, so the only thing I'm expecting now, I still haven't gotten my RAM in, and remarkably, I bought a few things from overseas. The RAM is the last thing I'm expecting, and that was not from overseas. Uh, so, Later. I'm really confused about the delivery times, but, eh, you know, it gets here when it gets here. I didn't pay for priority shipping, so okay, I'm not expecting, you know, anything fancy. Yeah, we clean up for you, so where's the note? Well, feeling a bit... Crabby today, are we? Courtney! Courtney! Look! Ow! Dead. Oh, and thanks for the note. Ciao! <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, she's... <laughs> <laughs> what? You just got wet. No names, Ashley. This is getting too much. Hey, Mary-Kate and Ashley. We hope we haven't waited too long to ask, but would you two like to hang out? At the beach this... Let us know. Hope it's yes. See you. School Beach. Saturday B. Saturday B. Okay. Okay. Sure. Uh, so I guess also there's more than five games in this one. Uh, which is for better or for worse, I guess. It does mean it's a little bit of a longer game. It's not too much longer, really. So it's still a one stream affair, but... So, uh, now I think we're we able to keep going around the rest of the hole. Nope. We closed off. I think we just go back into the main room and there's something somewhere. Ah, okay. The junior senior hole. Or the junior. The place we could never go into before. Hello, Mary Kate. You didn't happen to see Courtney? No. Sorry, Mary-Kate. 
Ah, uh, just walk into the gym. What could possibly go wrong? That's right, loading arcade. We had an arcade in the gym the whole time. You would have known. Hey, Mary Kate, don't look now, but there's Courtney. Oops, I looked. She's heading into the sports challenge. Hi, I'm sorry, but this area isn't open yet. It's reserved for student testers only. Well, that's why we're here. We're... Uh, yeah. We hope we're not late. <laughs> they sent us over from the school. What? Great. Would it kill, would it kill to, to teach people we're to just be here. honest? Like, it actually okay, hurts look, to just be there's like... three games that need testing. <sighs> when you beat the high score in the first one, then you can move on to the next. When you're done with all three, you're free to go. Sounds simple enough. Right. The quicker we get done, the quicker we can get back to finding Courtney. You could actually, you, you could ball. literally just say, sorry, we're not helping out. So look at this JPEG. Red targets, one. Blue targets, minus three. Oh, they're both, wait. Is that a minus? I actually cannot tell. That is super JPEG. Actually, I think blue is bad. So just red and yellow. Go! Okay, here she go. Hands on head. Uh, cool. Just jump to anything yellow if possible. All right. Cool. Cool. All right. Awesome. I can just hit every single target, bro. I'm not hitting that one. Blue is bad. Blue is blue. That was that was every single target, man. Can't chastise me on that one. Where's my yellow? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Alright. Got it. Bad. Okay. This is really involved for like a kid's arcade, like a, a high school. Cool. She's yeah. saying cool a lot. Cool. That means I've got to be doing something, right? Cool. This is that last second, last second pull. You can't do that. Uh, also, excuse me, that was a 30 score. Oh, oh, sorry. Where were, where were all the yellows awesome. before? Got it. Unless it just redid the first round for me. Am I, did I just start back from the beginning? Awesome. All right. Cool. Awesome. Cool. Did I just start awesome. back from the beginning, but it's just giving me yellows all of a sudden? Cause I swear, I swear there were no yellows the last time, right? I was gonna say, yeah, until he was. Now there's yellows. What? Cool. Just oddly, like, a little bit off, you know? It works, it's just, you know. These kinds of games are obviously right. like more fun if you got like an actual like light zapper or something to go with it. Bonk. Bonk. Just constantly throwing baseballs All at right. your cardboard. You can't cool. do anything about it. Yeah. All right. uh, there's so many yellows, man. Okay, again, 29 reds, but this time, oh look, there were four yellows. It's all good. Awesome. Cool. Did I just all hit right. the ship? I gave you a lot of time on this wave, though, I'll tell you that. Yeah. 
Some of these are kind of gnarly, like... At least the yellows don't have, like, less time than the other ones. I swear, if you aim left, it just, it'll just miss. Get her out of there, boat. Alright, what am I hitting? What, wh what was that? What was that angle? Okay, okay, who am I going for? Fish, awesome. fish, cool. fish, fish, dang it, fish, fish, nope, no fishies for me. I'm, I'm never this good at like real like target shooting as well. Cause you gotta like knock it as well. They don't count if you like baby cool. throw it. So, okay, so 37, I missed the blues and I got a lot of golds. 45, sure, I'm a god. Now we gotta do another game. Need 1500 points, get bonus treasures, don't get grey ones, don't get pirate, don't get shark. Cool. Go. Oh. Got it. Cool, yeah. alright. Oh, nope. I almost got it. Awesome. Alright. Awesome. Uh, da -da -da. I'm just hitting left, right, up, down, and then the triangle awesome. buttons so it looks like they're all just happening but it's just me like tapping the button immediately and then not responding to to shark shark is that good all right cool under the sea under the sea is this is this engrossing gameplay this is definitely like it's happening my brain is it's like it's oddly involved as well it's like I can actually imagine kids having a fun time with this one challenge each other to the high scores you know this one actually this one tickles a fancy you did it guys you did it you think it's weird that the time keeps going up every time I touch right. a seahorse as well? Cool. Cool. Yeah. Cool. It, it never goes. Okay, cool. I just, I just tapped on the pirate a couple of times. Cool. Uh, yeah. Alright, this is the All points right. bonus round. Hopefully those gems are worth lots of points. Cool. Oh, don't All touch right. the it was just so much like cool. sensory stuff going on I'm like just trying right. to like quickly react to it all, all right. it's really hard to like cool. spot the gem sorry the the pearls awesome. in like my peripheral yeah, got it. yeah okay so I just keep hitting the sharks it's just not good I don't think I made it no cool do it all over again cool All right, just don't hit the sharks. Cause the sharks were the bigger killer, biggest killer of my score. Awesome, got it. Awesome, cool. Da, 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 da. Got it. Cool. Yeah. Awesome, cool. cool. Yeah, I don't know. This year's been pretty neat. I don't know. I hope you you all have also enjoyed uh, just watching these streams and just cool. awesome. you know weird stuff I want to cool. show off. Basically, that's yeah. the main gist of. Cool. What I show and why I kind of say it. Is it interesting commentary? Maybe, maybe not. Up to you on that one. But uh, cool. 2022's been oh, a awesome. relatively cool. normal year, cool. I guess. Other than I wish my graphics card prices yeah. were cheaper. Awesome. Cool. Awesome. But, you know, exciting things still. I oh, tapped the shark. You lose like five seconds on the shark. Jeez. Awesome. Yeah. Got it. Maybe it's just easier right. to play it safer. And to try and like actually tap yeah. everything. Awesome, cool. Awesome, yeah. awesome, cool. All right, awesome. all right. This is a brain age mini game in hiding. Awesome, all right, cool. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. 
cool. Yes. All right. cool. Yes. Uh, left side is not liking me right now. Cool. There you go. Sorry, right. the right side, not the left side. Cool. Cool. All right. Cool. Cool. All right. Cool. Yeah. All right. Um. Cool. Yeah. I don't know. I hope you all have had a, uh, a great year as well. Um. I can definitely say as well, uh, yes, awesome. a general trend I've kind of cool. had is uh, shifting to a much more, um, cool. like, hands-off kind of experience when it comes to, you know, <laughs> uh, I guess for me, like, there's a lot of social media that right. uh, circles, awesome. how, do, how do I phrase it? it. Cool. Like, a lot of people I know interact awesome. with each other on social media, so it's kind of like an inevitability that I'm gonna, you know, have to go on social media to- I touched the shark. So, I'm doing pretty alright, I'm doing pretty alright. Well, that's already pushed me over, so as long as I don't lose points. Awesome. Let's yes. just crush cool. that record. Got it. Yes. Cool. Da, 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 da. Awesome. Yes. Um, cool. all right. But I've definitely kind of gone, hey, you know what, like, I'm- I'm really Got pushing it. myself cool. to be kind of less- uh, awesome. you know, reactive on social media. Um, which, granted, uh, I don't know if people are taking too kindly to me, like, dismissing, yeah, awesome. like, interactions just being, like, either they're bots or they're, um, yeah, awesome. not necessarily yeah. that you shouldn't interact cool. with trolls, but All more right. just, like, cool. there are people out there who are just gonna, like, anger right. you, and it's just better to just never do anything awesome. than to, like, cool. awesome. you know, respond yeah. or, or cool. awesome. react yeah. in some way, yeah. uh, the one thing I, I've tried learning not to do is, like, posturing and being like, Oh, this is reprehensible behavior. It's like, yeah, like, awesome. cool. I don't need to All say right. that, man. <laughs> you come to your own conclusion right. cool. on that. Cool. Uh, oh, touch the shark, but that's okay. Lots of cash. I swear there were more gems this time, so... Point is, that was good. Alright, now I gotta, hoops, shoot the ball into the basket with the flashing backboard. Red one point, blue two point, yellow three points. Stripe ball is double. Okay, oh. so... We Shoot into the yellow. Oh, I gotta shoot into the flashing backboard. Sorry, man. Uh, you're gonna go in. This is oddly specific. Like, you just tap the button, but it's like... Awesome. What exactly do you tap to get the ball to go in? I don't even... I've played this game, I don't even remember it. Is seven points okay? Okay, I need ten. Cool. Does it just keep going between these ones, or like... Just aim for the... just do a swiss shot every time. It's easier when you know that there's a pattern to it as well. Alright, here we go. Oh, hey, what's moving? Oh my gosh, that's high up. Oh my gosh! Just go in, please. It's, it's not even easier for the red one, it's just... Oh. Oh. This is, this is something they want kids awesome. to play. Just slam their head against the wall for a bit. Is that good enough? I don't know if that's good enough. 15? Oh, okay, sure. Uh, now I'm being body blocked. I'm actually being body blocked. This is... this is... Oh my gosh. Oh, I got it in, apparently. Just keep spamming X. Keep spamming it. Keep spamming it. Ball go, ball's going everywhere. This is... oh my gosh. How are you supposed to... how are you actually supposed to, like, get it in without, like, just some weird luck? 
getting lucky that you get the timing there, you know. <laughs> I'm just occasionally throwing the strike ball there, but... Oh, unless the strike ball is immediately after you get a, a score, in which case, yeah, no. <laughs> that ain't happening, man. I'm just going in for the lucky shots. I'm going in for the lucky shots. I think that's over 10, unless they changed the, you know, they changed the number on me. Oh, look at that, now I gotta do it all over again. It's like, yeah, I can deal with this, I can't deal with the hand being in the way. Gosh, who decided that the Mary Kate and Ashley game is hard? Who decided, who did this? It's not even like crazy difficult, it's just... <laughs> it goes for longer than you'd really want it to. Listen, can, can my score just carry over? But yeah, I still think that there's a... Uh, you know, things that I want to... You know, do... I guess also, like, you know, if you're not interacting on social media, are you missing out on engaging with people? Well, maybe, but... Uh, I found I've had a lot of time to, to learn some stuff. Uh, for example, I have learned a bit of rustling, which is pretty neat. I have learned to kind of fear rustling as well, which is pretty neat. So, how do people use it? All right. The lifetime specified, it seems like it just gets in the way. But, who knows, there'll be a Rust person out there who goes, Oh, you're totally wrong, man. It saves you so much compiler headache. Or, or not compiler headache. It is compiler headache, but it, uh, saves you from having a, you know, worry about the lifetime of the thing because it's compiler checked. Which is neat, actually, but... Okay, okay, just, just get it in. like that hand is just like so much in the way okay I'm feeling all right as long as I can get this one there you go I wonder if Mary Kate and Ashley can legitimately do like basketball throws like this not because they're girls because you know, nowadays it's like not because they're girls. Who, why would you say that? <laughs> All right, Ashley, we did it. Yeah, now we're free to get back to finding that little problem of ours. Gosh, I've been ah! saying so many problematic things. Ah, oh, she can't Talking handle the balls. Problem. She was trying to this juggle six of them away. at once. Neural. We'll catch up with her later. This is such like a Los Let's Angeles thing to just like have a beach. Hey, Mary Kate and Ashley, we hope we haven't waited too long to ask. But would you two like to hang out at the beach this let us know? Hope it's yes. See you both at the school beach party on Saturday. B? B? I hope we haven't waited too long. Mayor Kate, if these guys are really cute, could they have given up on us by now? <laughs> uh, have they even been doing schoolwork today? Arguably, man. Arguably. Got some guts to, like, make a game where you are in school as well. And not just like turn into like educational. It's not even an educational game. It's just. It's it's just a mini game collection. Centered around a school, but it's not actually educational. Kind of bizarre. Brandon, have you decided who you're hooking up with at the beach bash? Nah, <coughs> not yet. Whoa, let me get the old cam rolling. Brandon, the captain of the football team, dateless. Dream <coughs> on, Brett. I've got the invite out, and I'm just chilling back, waiting for the big yes. Excuse me, you didn't happen to see Courtney? Nope, but knowing her, she probably has headed to the mall for a complete wardrobe to wear at the beach bash. Thanks. Uh, okay, so, oh, in I go. We are now loading tryouts, that is correct. They couldn't just do it once. Parappa the Rapper has to return again.
Okay, girls, are you ready? Oh, we had to I've bring the swimsuits out. Left for the beach party dance squad. So give it your they best. Yeah, technically, not Why wearing shoes, but I, I don't know if anyone would be interested what in whatever the heck that here? was at the bottom that of those spot legs. spot has my name all over it. Well, like, look, I'm still hoping to get a piece of the note. But being on the dance squad doesn't sound so bad. At like least that. they've... I don't know. The hands are a little more involved this time, but... Oh, for the part? Are you kidding? I don't know, man. I Character models you, in the PS1 era was me, very hit and miss. But they put in a lot of effort in the hair textures. You got a deal. I'll ride over there. I hope you're yeah, ready. at least the faces aren't like absolutely terrifying. But the mouths are weird. Sequence, and all ooh, you have to ooh, do she's vibing. Her waist is like popping off her legs right now. With the best timing and control. Ooh, <laughs> just, the just headbutt your sister. Wow. All the dances. This will be a piece of cake. A piece More of like cake. More like a piece of note, Courtney. Well, just, just. Okay. Left. Right. Did I hope you enjoy more Parappa the Rapper? Left. Gotta get that star power. Right. Up. Down. Down. Up. Oh, <laughs> that's the same move. Up. Down. Down. Up. That's the same right. move. That weird like kick Left. move. I don't Left. even know. These Down. some incredibly stilted animations right. as well. Is any kid like looking at this going, Ah yes, I totally want to recreate Up. that dance move. Down. Down. Up. Down. Up. It's like a right. contractual obligation right. dance move, right. you know? I was never really into, interested Up. in dance. Someone's probably going to tell me like there was Up. a fine art to it all. And that Up. I just don't understand it. I just right. don't understand. It's first Kick. the rustling people. Spin. And now the dance people. Kick. Spin. Spin. Kick. Up. Down. Kick. Oh. Spin. Kick. Some of these moves look painful as well. Down. Kick. Spin. Kick. Right. Left. Right. Left. Spin. Kick. Spin. <laughs> that was not Spin. a kick. kick. Right. Left. Right. Left. Spin. Kick. Spin. Kick. Spin. Kick. Why is it also tryouts though? I don't down, know. Down. Left, right, left. Right, left, right. Up. Up. Down. Down. Left, right, left. Right. Courtney's left, messing right, up a ton, spin, bro. Kick. Kick. Spin. Kick. Up. Up. Down. Spin. Kick. Kick. Spin. Kick. Are they going to say it's a rhythm game just because there's like a constant bar that's going over? Even though there's like such a pause between you like doing your move and the next one. What's with the different length phrases as well? My bar's already full. I'm just constantly okay, going. This might be tough. Oh, memorize the dance we gotta memorize. I'm feeling good about this. All right, we got down and up. We got down and up, gang. We're going down and up. Down. At least it's not memorize up. and reverse. That'd be fun. Up, up, right, down, up. down, left. We're going up. clockwise. Right. Seriously, some of those moves just look painful. Up, up, right, down, down. Uh, for reference right. as well, you can't just listen out for them down. and try and press it quick. Because uh, they say it when I press spin, the button. Spin. So down, XX, triangle, up. and triangle, to up. Down, kick, XX, kick. triangle, spin, triangle, spin. up. Yeah, my bar's already full, man. I'm already done. Up, left, right, down. Up, left, right, down. Up, left, right, right down. Up, left, right, down. Down. Up. Left. Right. right. Down. Spin. Triangle down, up, X. Down. Up. It's like a fish, isn't it? Yeah. 
triangle, down, up, X, left, left, triangle, triangle, triangle. Spin, spin, left, left, spin, 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 up, down. Up, down, left, right, left, up, down, triangle, X, triangle. This is fairly involved, isn't it? Up, down, left, right, left, up, down, spin, kick, spin. How about another challenge? Now do the opposite of what I do. This is like taking notes from a baby. Just, just talking over it, man. Left, okay. I don't have to memorize it. Just start with left. Down, down. Right, right. Left. She even reads out the wrong one as well. But trust me, I'm hitting the other direction. Down. Oh, with X. Down. Kick. Left. Kick. Oh, I gotta spin. internalize right. these ones, I tell ya. Spin. Down. Kick. Left. Kick. Spin. Right. Spin. Spin. There we go. Left. Right. Kick. Right. Left. Spin. Left. Right. Kick. Right. Left. I'm going strong. I'm going Down. strong. Up. Left. Spin. Kick. Down. Kick, right, I'm going strong. Left, I'm going strong. Right, I'm doing it. Left, I'm hundred percenting this uh, kids down, game. Kick, spin, it's got to mean something good. Right, left, right, left, up, spin, kick, down, kick, spin, up. <laughs> look down, at all these. Down, nut, look at all these arrows. Up, down, left, right, left, this is so involved. Right, this left, is so right, involved. Up, up, down, down, I think the developers. Down, Played this down, too many times. Left, I got right, too good at it. Right, left, right, <laughs> spin, kick, kick, spin, kick, up, up, down, spin, kick, kick, spin, kick, up, up, down. There we go. Perfection okay, girls, yet again. My name is Let Blendo. Let me get the scores together, and I'll be over there in a sec. Not bad, Ashley. But I still think the dance team spot is mine. First the cheerleading spot, Here now the dance team spot, no girls, and you're just taking you all of it. Real hard, but unfortunately, we can only take one of you. Why, well, yes, we wrote the exact and same the script for two different levels is... that you're required to do. Ashley, congratulations! I guess right. it's a, I guess it's a different it. twin. How about that piece of the note, Courtney? Courtney? Hey, part of the note. Why she keep leaving them behind? You think she'd like just never let go of one of them? Well, Ashley, we've got all the pieces except the most important one. Hey, Mary Kate and Ashley, we hope we haven't waited too long to ask, but would you two like to hang out with us at the beach this weekend? Let us know. Hope it's yes. See you both at the school beach party on Saturday. B, now. I don't know about you. But why am I not surprised that the final piece of the note contains the name of our mystery dates? Hmm. This is very important. This is the most important piece of info, and it's being withheld from us until, you know, we, we accomplish the very, very last minigame. I think it's the last one. Probably is. I know this game's not too crazy long, so let's slam it out. Overall, I guess this game, you know, it's, a, it's another minigame game. I'm, I don't know why I sound surprised. I'm the one who knew the game and just went in with it anyways. That's right. That's right. Journalism. Take two. I guess they really did only have five mini games and they decided to stretch it out. You have picking up stuff off the beach, taking photos, Parappa the Rapper, golf. I can't even recall Mr. what the last White? one was. Hey girls, looks like it's my lucky day. What do you mean? Well, I'm substituting for Mrs. Redding's journalism classes while she's down helping with the beach bash setup. And let me guess, she just happens to have a yearbook photo assignment that needs to be completed ASAP too. Bingo! Well, you did a great job on mine. But Mary Kate, what about Courtney and the note? Look, while you help with these pictures, you can look for Courtney, plus... Plus? Yes, plus I'll employ Byron, the human Courtney radar, to help. He's stopping by in just what? a minute. You got a deal. Oh my gosh. Boy, boy, right there. Uh, 
<laughs> I'll, I'll employ Byron. Meanwhile, Kevin's stuffing Byron in his freshman locker. Oh, yeah, it's totally normal and acceptable practice. Uh, so, okay, Bruce entertaining two admirers, chilling practice in the gym, Brandon catching some Zeds in sophomore hall, stuff in locker, okay. Out the door, we got six minutes, same thing, except the map is super large again. Uh, so let's go forward, because this is a completely different wing of the school, and despite the rooms touching each other, you cannot go from one to the other. Perfectly normal school layout, let me tell you that. Uh, is the arrow just slightly off? I think the arrow is just very off. Because, like, there should be a corridor right in the middle here, but sure. Bruce, thanks for your help on the physics project. This shot will look great on the Science Club webpage. Thank you for helping cool. with the, the physics project. Second account. Oh. Excuse me. Can you, can you bugger off, ladies? Cheese. That's gotta be good, right? Have a nice day. Cool, okay. The, the 12 pieces of film is gonna get very annoying if it's just like, yep, doesn't, didn't work, sorry man. Try it again. I don't know if the music license, we'll, we'll figure it out once it arrives on YouTube. How about some action shots cool. for the yearbook girls? Let's go! Yearbook pictures! Cool. Who who am I supposed to center Ready? on? Where's the lens? Jeez. Oh, the squat shot. Who who is the center of the frame? Are you the center? You are the center of the frame. Have a nice day. That is. Oh boy, they weren't even named. They weren't even named. Running around, running around. Do they ever just sit down in class in the school? No. Come on, Byron, say cheese, cheese for Ashley. Oh, oh, wait, guys, don't you want to think this out before you really want to do? Uh, ow, oh, ow, ow, something hit me. Where are my glasses? Someone, anyone, can you hear me? I have severe claustrophobia and I hate small dark places. My brain can't handle it. Uh, uh, my glasses. Help! The kid. Help! <laughs> the audio pop gets me every time. The kid's having a panic attack. He's getting shoved in a locker and it's just like, oh yeah, just publish it for everyone to see. Like, yeah, he's, he's a weirdly, like, obsessive, nerdy guy. He doesn't deserve this, man. What the heck? Oh, but Mary Kate and Ashley are the popular ones. We're the popular kids. Actually, we're the kids just like you. We go to school too. I swear. Runs for the winning goal. The crowd goes wild. Oh my gosh, you gotta take the photo when he like turns towards you. Got it. Yeah. Okay. Seriously, like, yeah, like, what actually were the lifestyles of Mary Kate and Ashley as they were, like, you know, preteens, the teens? Like, like, did they ever go to schools with everyone else? They just seemed like they were eternally in Hollywood business. I mean, I guess, like, you know, all celebrities and, you know, awesome. go to school and juggle school in the meantime. That's why you don't see like child actors get spammed like too much, but I feel like Mary Kay and Nash are definitely on the higher end of that. You know, they do so many photo shoots and, and shows and movies and go to all these places and stuff. Uh, Otis, great name, sneaking in a donut break in the senior common area. Gladys balancing dishes in the cafeteria kitchen. Surprised the faculty practicing their talent show skit in the senior hall. And Billy showing off his artistic talent in the freshman hall. So again, we just walk around everywhere, I guess. That's right, there's a courtyard out here. Pictures? Sure. Mind if okay. I keep eating? Act natural. Okay, I got I it. put in all the effort to write donuts on the side of that box, I'll tell you that. That's dedication. 
I'd love to pose for you, Thank but geez. whoa! But whoa! Oh, hi. Do you mind coming back? Hi. Do you mind coming back? Ah, uh, please stop. That's facing me. They're not facing me. Cool. Just turn this way. There you go. Thank you very much. I like that. How do people legitimately chuck on like that much like blue like eyeshadow? I don't understand like crazy amounts of eyeshadow. I don't understand makeup in general, to be honest. Like, I mean, you know, it's more just like, yeah, I mean, you know, there's people with natural looks. There are people with, you know, that cover up the natural looks or, you know, accentuate facial features. It's fine. I don't understand blue eye, like, you know, or weird colored lipsticks. It's just, I don't know, man. Just, just, just walk through the cones. Like, oh. You know what I mean? The guys can agree, the girls will always go, what's going on? Hi. Yeah, see, I'm walking straight through the middle of the school right here. This map does not line up to reality, and they just let it slide. Uh, is, who is in this classroom? Okay, gentlemen. Ready? What am I looking at here? If I hear any cracks from the team, they'll be doing push-ups for forever. Miles! What am I looking at here? S someone else is in the picture. Who is supposed to be the whole faculty? Smile. I assume it's the guy in the middle is supposed to be facing you. I like that. Hey, okay, sure. Again, also, what am I looking at here? It's actually, I, I, I will say, my, my high school teachers like did pull pranks. Not pranks, but like... You know, the, the weird, like, thing for the talent show or the, the year 12, like, farewells. But, like, it wasn't, like, that weird. Mine really wasn't that weird. It was just kind of like, oh, okay. It gets you to realize that your teachers are not just, uh, you know, solar shells. But solar shells that occasionally crack once a year. Just for you. And only once. And they're back to normal, regular people. Nah, I, lo I love my high school teachers. They're all cool. Is this this? That's, is that your artistic talent? You're just lying in the hole? Sure, okay. Great artistic talent. Is this even the freshman hall? Oh, wait, this is where the car collided with the wall. You're patching it over. What's the, what's the term? Dynamic storytelling or something like that. Environmental storytelling. We have environmental storytelling in our Mary Kate and Ashley video game. He's in the freshman hall, right? This is the freshman hall. Is it not? Oh. It wasn't the freshman hall. That's okay. Seems to be its chemistry. Oh, where where is he? Whoa, oh, no pictures. I got my image, you know. Okay, act natural. Take a photo. Turn turn for me. Turn for me, bro. I'm gonna bump ya. I'm gonna bump ya. You're gonna, you're gonna smile on this side. Stay it's, it's clearly gonna Great campaign. Shot. Oh, okay. He doesn't need to be facing the camera this time. You just, just go for it. Sure. Nope. <laughs> which, which direction does the school go in? I have a radar that's as detailed as the Legend of Zelda on the NES. There you go. I'm in. That's it. Cool. Wave that camera around. I got him. Film reels back then were crazy expensive. Like you'd walk around. You'd have a you'd have a Kodak. There's like a weird buzzing in the left ear. I don't know if that's. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so, Mr. Adams cleaning up the mess in the senior physics hall, coach dealing with a small problem at the main office, 
Brian hanging up the school beach party banner. Mrs. Appleton, sophomore home ec teacher, needs some cooking lessons. Great. Pictures. Ready. Smile for the camera, Brian. Whoa. Wait a minute. Bonk. Have a nice day. That was a great picture, everyone. Anyone chilling out there? Nope. Keep the kids gated up. Don't let them see the outside world. Man, they're, they're teenagers. You kind of need a bit of security, to be honest. Gosh, these holes just keep going on, man. Hi. What is going on here? Oh, okay, so I need to just arrive at the other side. Did he just blow up a lab? Does that usually happen? There was actually a... I, I'm pretty certain there was actually a recent, like, news story of, like, that happening, where it's like a teacher, like, ignite... Morty! Jeez. What the heck? I think that's actually, yeah, Mr. Adams, so I need to take a picture of... Of him right here. He's gonna run out any day now. Got it. <laughs> That's right, the music is like a one minute loop. I will say, I'm glad there are bathrooms everywhere. Like, every corner you go, there's always, like, there's two bathrooms there. There was, like, two before. I'm gonna walk down here. Okay, there's actually a while until the bathrooms. Let's get them in the main hall. Alright, to the freshman hall? At the main office, I guess, and then in the sophomore home ec teacher, so I guess they teach home ec to sophomores. Ho. Ah, what was me? Shot. You can take all the pictures you want, just get that thing out of here. Why do people hate rats? Like, sure, yeah, they spread diseases, but like, that's just kind of it, you know? It's not too bad. It's not like they're gonna bite you. Most of the time. They, they might bite you, actually. You can get a pet rat. Teach it to not bite you. Teach it to just go, hey, I have food. I'm going to assume the home ec teacher is in a home ec class. Okay, everyone is apparently ruining every meal they've ever done in their entire lives. Alright. A home ec class doesn't even have desks. It's just like a bunch of fridge counters. I guess it's, that's probably what it is, isn't it? Like, you don't sit down to learn home ec. Well, maybe you do at times, but you gotta do it. You gotta have a room set up with a few stoves and stuff. I never had home ec in my high school. I would have loved to take home ec, because I legit, like, have no idea about cooking. Like, I can do the basics, but you ask me to, like, you know, sous vide? Nah, man. I eat his souvé and my brain's thinking I just pop it in a plastic bag for like three hours. Awesome. Which is totally not how you do a souvé. Unless it is. You put it in like a hot water Ray bath. Isn't that actually it? All the pictures. All yeah, the pictures. No sign of Courtney. How did our secret weapon make out? Mystery note anyone? I, he made out. How did he get that? Yeah, we've had to jump through hoops. My guess is even Courtney has her limits. Courtney, you're a vision more beautiful than the flicking flame of a Bunsen burner. More exciting than a subdividing amoeba under a 500x microscope. Uh, stop, stop. This says something we that he's able point. to recite it Thanks by word. Help, also that he's basically Let's like just mocking a student behind his back. This is what all kids Finally, do. Ashley. Hey Mary Kate and Ashley. We hope we haven't waited too long to ask, but would you two like to hang out with us at the beach this weekend? Let us know. Hope it's yes. See you both at the school beach party on Saturday. Bruce and Chad. Bruce, he's one of the smartest guys in the school. And cute, too. And Chad, his good looks and brains. Mm, I'll never forget the fun we had as science partners. So I, what I want to figure out is, 
there's always like in all the, the the pairs of boys always one of them starts off with a b and i'm curious if that last one is random or whether you actually just get one based on the performance you do or whether it's always bruce and chad i don't think i've played this game enough times to really care i kind of don't want to as well so uh yeah all's well that ends well ashley this is going to be the best beach bash ever I can't believe we're meeting two of the cutest guys in school. Believe me, I can't either. And you can bet I'll help make sure it's a day you'll never forget. Well, Courtney, you're right. Mr. Warden, I was... You were just about to tell Mary-Kate and Ashley how you were going to make this the best beach bash ever. Yeah. And Courtney, I've got a plan for you that will help you to make that happen. See you at the beach, girls. I'm not gonna just threaten them. I've got a feeling we're not gonna see much of Courtney at the beach. Yeah, we're gonna miss her. Nah. Ah, oh, bully side. Good morning, and welcome to your Valley High Beach Bash. Contestants in this year's King of the Beach Surf Contest, there's a meeting at the lifeguard stand in 10 minutes. Sign up for the Oh my gosh, 10 minutes. To the volleyball Jeez. Course. That's always a bash favorite. For a complete schedule of the day's events, check out the information booth. Hey, there you two are. Hey. Hi, Chad. Hi, Bruce. Hi. We figured you two would be out here catching some rays. But calculating your exact position was quite difficult. <laughs> what? You know, you got back to us on our invitation. Oh my gosh, he's got like a time. bleeding... Sure. He's got like we Einstein.exe, the t-shirt. ...for the beach bash today. Ooh. Glad we saved you. Oh, the legs aren't moving. The torso is just rotating on top of it. Oh. Well, we better get a move on it, because according to my calculations, we only have 5.372 hours to have a blast. Anyone up for some miniature golf? Count me in. Me too. We're a little rusty, so take it easy on us. Oh, Courtney, you don't know how excited I was when Mr. Warden told me you requested to be assigned to my Beach Bash support team. Byron, I didn't. Courtney, you don't have to explain a thing. Love does strange things to people. <laughs> I would prefer to Byron. tell the teachers about this Felix kind of... He once cleaned the lab equipment five times just to stay in class with his high school sweetheart. <laughs> and then there was my Aunt Vera two times removed. Oh, side. just tell a teacher and just like actually file a restraining order. Like, geez, man. Watch her crush process overdue books. Like, I know, I know. They're making fun of like the nerdy kid is, is way out of his league, but also just like, you know, he's got some weird body proportions going on. All right, I can't believe it. We did it, Ashley. We did, oh, we did it, so. That's it. That's the game that is Mary Kay and Ashley Crush Course. A a better game, but also I mean it's it's another one of these games. Uh So yeah. I that's pretty much that's pretty much it. I don't have much to say other than like you know, hey, there's a bit more mini golf involved. Um a bit forgiving as well, although the pass scores are way out of my league. Uh did I even Let's let's just double check as well. Did I even uh you know unleash the demons? The answer is I unlocked 14 hardcore achievements. Uh I assume two of them were yeah dancing without missing a note, which I did get, but then the other ones start getting a bit trickier. Complete a game of mini golf in activity mode with a grade A total. Score a hole in one in refrigerator. Uh Cap it all in two swings or less. Complete the collection mini game in activity mode. Uh, achieve a score of 50, 115 or more in the final round of ball toss. Excuse me. And then achieve a score of 22 points or more in the final round of hoops. I think all of that as well. You can play from the uh, from the menu, but yeah, uh, it's creepy that they're blinking. They're blinking on the screen. Listen, the curse of the magical mystery mall bracelet has hit them. They are stuck in time. They will forever be <laughs> at the beach. They'll never leave. So, anyway, yeah, the Olsen twins are, are weird. Not weird as in, you know, strange, creepy individuals. They're a little bit of that. 
they're celebrities. It kind of happens. But it's also like, they're celebrities. What is, what is this bizarre, like, pushing of just these these teens as a... Uh, as uh, some kind of iconic thing of the, the 90s and 2000s. They... The, the music expected a bit more out of this. Let's see if the music loops. I swear, this isn't like a glitch or anything. This is just... I'm expecting a fade out. The fade out is taking its time. It's almost there. Yeah, no, that naturally just stopped. That that was just naturally a bit too long. So, yeah, you can play activities. You can... Oops. What a brilliant menu, by the way. Also, by clicking mini golf, it takes you to some random hole. Like, I'm going to load in. And we're on this, which I think was the last hole, but it's it's a hole one par three, so okay. You know, at least there's a bit of score attacking on some of these, so sure. You could play with more than one player on the cheerleading. Uh, I hope you hate uh, text aligning because it just keeps going wider. So anyway, that's that's that. That's. Meeting boys, the video game. Maybe one day I'll be able to ask out the boys in the same way the boys asked me out. But until then, I would like to thank you so very, very, very much for watching. So if you did enjoy this, uh, feel free to follow on Twitch or subscribe on YouTube or whatever. If you missed any bits of it, you can always uh, watch back on the VODs on YouTube. Um, where, yep, pretty much all the VODs end up there. Uh, I didn't even say what the schedule was, so point is, probably gonna do the computer build um, sometime in the next week, hopefully if the RAM comes on anytime soon. Um, and then uh, from there on out, it's uh, probably a quickie. I'll come up with something quickie for next week. Don't wanna don't wanna hang on for like too long, but just a nice small quickie stream. Um, and then yeah, I'll be I'll be having a bit of chill time with my family for the holiday season, so it'll be a couple of weeks. And then I'll be back, back at it. 2023, you know, it's just like 2022, but with a three in the year. Uh, so anyway, stay safe, eat your greens, don't stay up too late, and remember to uh, put the milk and cookies out for Santa. I'll be here next week, don't worry. So catch you, fellas. See ya.